Dean Dempsey is standing by with your Hollywood headlines now. Hey, friends. Okay, so Billboard has unveiled its top artists of 2017. Gentlemen, he has broken the record for the most Billboard Music Awards in a single year. Drake. He used to call me on my cell phone. Drake stole the show at last night's Billboard Music Awards, snagging a record-breaking 13 honors, including the award for top artist. Adele held the previous record, earning 12 trophies in 2012. Other highlights include Celine Dion's emotional performance of the award-winning song My Heart Will Go On from the blockbuster film Titanic, and a performance by Cher, who took home this year's Icon Award. And, and I've been doing it for 53 years. Yeah. Now, this is not an applause thing. I'm 71 yesterday. So. Yes. And I can do a five-minute plank, okay? <laughs> Just saying. As soon as I get home, I'm on that. the ground, on the yoga mat, doing my planks. As soon as I get home. Uh -huh. She is no better joke. be at least five minutes. I'll start with 30 seconds. <laughs> Wow. The singer wrapped up her speech by thanking her mom and crediting a lot of her success to plain old luck. Whew. So you know that means the celebs hit the red carpet. We got to do some fashion for them. A little pass or bell. fail action happening later on this morning. So make sure you <laughs> tune in for the 9 o'clock hour for fashion for them. Mm -hmm. We're and so judgy. We're so judgy. <laughs> today, so today judgy. we're letting you, the viewer, get in on it, okay? Because we're going to do Insta poll and find out what you say, pass or fail for a couple of these artists. Wait till you see. Ooh. Wait till you see. It's going to be fantastic. Okay, in casting news, Janelle Monet has landed her next big screen role. The Hidden Figures actress has signed on to star in a new film from director Robert Zemeckis. The project will be a fictionalized version of a 2010 documentary about a man who builds a miniature World War II era village as a form of therapy after suffering a brain injury. Monet will star alongside Steve Carell and Leslie Mann. No word on when that film is going to be released. And fans of anime legend Hayao Miyazaki have something to be excited about. The 76-year-old director is coming out of retirement just to start production on one last film. Tech website and gadget.com reports a job listing from Miyazaki's studio surfaced online seeking artists and animators. The Post emphasized new hires would be working on Miyazaki's final feature under a three-year contract. Miyazaki originally uh, announced his retirement in 2013 after the release of his film, The Wind Rises. Production on his new movie begins in October. My name is Alice, and this is my story. And just when you thought this was story. the end of the Resident Evil story, Variety reports a reboot is in the works. Six more. <laughs> But wait though, <laughs> wait though, Jules. Six more films are reportedly being planned. The franchise was set to end with this year's the final chapter. No word on a cast, a potential director for the reboot. Details are being kept under tight wraps. So when you say the final chapter, what you had meant to say was, it's kind of the final chapter, maybe, but then we might change our minds. Ish. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not really the final Weird. chapter. <laughs> That's it for your Hollywood headlines, guys. Yikes. Good stuff. <laughs> thanks, Court. All right, thanks. Well,